Hi, Fritz Kindergartners. It's a beautiful spring day at my house. I'll bet it is at yours, too. Spring makes me think of chicks and bunnies and ducks. Wait a minute. Ducks? Ducks? That makes me think of my favorite duck character, Fix-It Duck. Maybe you've heard of him before. Maybe you've heard his story, or maybe this will be the first time. Whether it's the first time or the 51st time, I think you're going to enjoy my story about Fix-It Duck. My story is by Jez Allborough, published by Harper Collins Children's Books. It's got lots of rhyming words in the story. See if you can pick out some of the rhymes. Fix-It Duck. Just take a really close look at this picture. It's a key to what's going to happen. Fix it, duck. Plop goes the drip that drops in the cup. Duck looks down. Duck looks up. Wow. A leak in the roof? Oh, what bad luck. This is a job for... Fix it, duck. He says it's easy to repair, but how's he going to get up there? He can't climb. It's much too steep. So he drives around to borrow a ladder from sheep. Over the puddles he hops and he skips to Sheep's little house. Then, oops, he trips. Sheep, called Duck, it's only me. And he explains how the rain had dripped in his tea. When he reaches the part about fixing the leak, they hear a rattle, creak, and a squeak. My window says sheep, it won't close. It's stuck. This is a job for fix it duck. He does what he can to close up the gap. He glues it, he screws it, and gives it a tap. Uh -uh. The problem, says duck, is your glass is too thin. The rain's coming in. What we need, says Duck with a glint in his eye, is to pull your house to some place that's dry. Did he fix anything yet? <laughs> God's got a shed. It can shelter inside. Let's hook up your Jeep. Let's go for a ride. Drive back slowly till I see stop. All of a sudden, something goes pop. Can you see it? A puncture, says Duck. More bad luck. We'll have to use my pickup truck. The sheep's little house won't join to the truck. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? This is a job for Fix It Duck. They're off, says Duck as they speed down the track. Slow down on the bends, calls Sheep from the back. Turn left, he bleats as they skid round the curve. Hold tight, comes the quack. As the truck starts to swerve. And the house should follow behind. But instead... It unhooks from the truck and rolls on straight ahead. When Duck gets to goats, he starts to explain why they brought Sheep's house, which was letting in rain. But where is it? asked Goat. 
And as Duck turns to see, Frog runs up shouting, It's following me! Look up on the hill, gasps Goat in dismay. It's she, Quacks Duck, he's coming this way! Run, cries Frog, he's going to crash! Please, sheep. Splash. It's broken, says Duck. What a lot of bad luck. Oh, no, Mom, sheep. Not fix it, Duck. If only he hadn't come calling on me. If only that rain hadn't dripped in his tea. Not rain, says Frog, with a shy little cough. Think back to that first page. Do you know where the water came from? He forgot to turn his bath tap off. Looks like he's got some cleaning up to do. So fix a duck didn't ever really fix anything, did he? I hope your day goes better than fix a duck's day. Have a great one.